everyone welcome to darshan journey in this video i'm super excited to discuss about my first python project created for managing passwords please consider liking sharing and subscribing to my channel since it motivates me more to create such content for you guys without further delay let's get started How do we usually manage passwords? We typically use a diary, but we have found that managing and updating it can be quite challenging and time consuming. Have you considered using Notepad instead? While it's a better alternative to a diary, but it's not very secure. If someone gains access to your computer, they could potentially find all of your passwords. So you might think be thinking about Google Password Manager, right? Yeah, that's a good choice, but you should enable 2FA, two factor authentication. 2FA adds an extra layer of security. However, if someone logs into your PC or Gmail account, they can still access all of your data. Now, you might consider using a cloud-based password manager app. Yes, that's an excellent choice. Your data is stored in a cloud, making it inaccessible to others. Additionally, you will have benefits of data backups. However, keep in the mind that you may need to pay for a subscription to use the service. How about pvault.exe? pvault is a GUI based app developed using PyCharm. It also has an inbuilt function that can generate complex passwords based on the input of characters. You can save the password based on the service slash account and update the password in the future. The passwords are secured using a hashing algorithm known as AES which is an essentially a military grade level hashing mechanism making it nearly impossible for anyone to decrypt the file however it's worth noting that this app is only advisable on windows and not compatible with other operating systems like linux android and iphone and others Additionally, there is no cloud backup feature, but you could use OneDrive for that purpose. Also, the app is completely free. I have included the download link in the description. Please download it and give it a try and then share your feedback with us. Allow me to demonstrate my application. Double click on the pvault.exe. It will pop up a window asking you to create your master password. If you don't know what is a master password, it's basically a key in order to access the rest of your passwords that is saved in the application. In my case, I'm performing a demo, so I'll be using a weak master password 1234. In case of real use, please create a stronger master password. After you enter your desired master password, click on the save icon. Now this will allow you to access the main application. Now let me demonstrate the features. Click on the generate password icon. This feature basically allows you to generate a password based on how many characters you input. So in my case, I'll be using 12 characters. If you want a strong password, please use 18 characters or 20 characters. Now that I have covered the generate password function, let me show you how to store a password in this PV Vault application. Click on the store new and type your platform as Gmail in my it's just an example, okay? And type the account as Tarshan DJ at the rate of gmail.com. I'm typing this in my case. In case of real use, you could type whatever you want and the real password. So after you type the account, please type the password in. So I will be using the password that I have generated using the generate password function. Like this, we could create multiple entries. So let me explain the features that have appeared in the site. Copy ACC stands to copy the account like Darshan DJ at the rate of gmail.com. And copy pass copies the password. And update icon helps you to update the password. Like example, let me just type a random password. And as you can see, it updated it. Now the delete icon deletes the whole thing. As you can see, platform account and password are now empty. Now that we have covered the generate password function and the store new function, let me show you where the database is saved and how it works. So here is the database for my application. So basically when you download the exe, wherever it's downloaded, there only the database will be stored. In my case, I have downloaded it in my OSC, Users, RPath, Pycham Projects, Password Generator and Outward. 
So as you can see, here's a DB and this is fully encrypted so that no one can see it. Let me just open, click open with or uh, open using notepad and as you can see it's fully encrypted this does not look like the password that i saved that's right guys this app is completely free and i have included the download link in the description please download it give it a try and then share your feedback with us thank you and have a wonderful day